Midday, police say the Omaha daycare owner caught on camera allegedly abusing a four-year-old has been arrested. 3 News Now reporter Shante Passmore has more on this developing story. Shante? Emily, in Harrison County, Iowa, that's where Omaha police say Lynn Rowe finds herself behind bars this midday. She's the owner of Lynn's Learning Center near 112th and Center. Authorities there in Iowa arrested her last night as she's accused of felony child abuse. And we need to warn you, the video you're about to see, it's hard to watch. Police say they began investigating after a former daycare employee recorded video of Roe allegedly hitting and shaking a four-year-old girl. According to court documents on March 28th, Roe taught a lesson to preschoolers when she became upset with that little girl, knowing something was going to escalate. The employee pulled out her cell phone and started recording. She told police she was too shocked and scared to intervene. Two days later, the employee showed the video to the little girl's parents, Al and Kelly Myers. I spoke to the parents today. They tell me they're beyond relieved she's caught. We're glad that she's going to finally have to take some responsibility for what she did, and we're very thankful to Detective Flynn and the Omaha Police Department and everyone involved in finding her. The Myers say they've known Roe for years. She's watched the girl and even her older brother. When the brother saw the video, they say their son said Roe did a similar thing, but Roe told him not to say anything. The mother tells me the center cared for about a dozen kids. Last Friday, police told Roe's lawyer she was going to be charged with a felony. That attorney said she was out of state, which prompted an arrest warrant. Last night in Iowa, authorities arrested her in Missouri Valley. Roe's, Roe's lawyer tells me his client was not hiding and plan to turn herself in this morning. Live, Shante Passmore, 3 News Now, Midday.